Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm unboxing the Super Mario Brothers The Movie Root and Go Puzzle Game. So we'll get straight into it. We'll show you the packaging guys, then we'll open everything up, get a closer look. Do let us know in the comments what you think guys. And if you haven't already, do subscribe to the channel. So very nicely detailed on the front. You can see a nice image there. A um, couple of people playing and all the uh, different parts that are involved. Then on, on the uh, back goes into more detail about the actual parts and the um, the functions and features of this uh, particular puzzle game. Okay, so let's open it up and get everything set up. What I'll do is I'll probably set it up off camera, guys. Uh, looks like there's some stickers to um, install and stuff like that. And then in the outro, I'll run through how it all plays and uh, what it all looks like once it's all together. Okay. So that is everything out of the box. Let's take a look at the uh, individual parts. So some assembly required. It's obviously, um, I don't know if it's, you can randomize it or it's the same each time, but like I said, I'll um, take a read and check all that out. So here's a couple of red bits. That one goes up and down. So that could be start or finish or both. Got our car. Couple of um, couple of buttons here. So we've got a couple of black buttons. Uh, we've got our Mario Bros plumbing vehicle. It doesn't get used much to, uh, in the actual film. Um, so here it is. Got your um, tools on the top there, and it's just going to uh, roll around on the. Uh, actual puzzle game you've got uh, stop play and fast forward or rewind on there so i assume that comes into play but uh like i said i need to um, take a read of the instructions and work all that out now i've got a couple more panels so we've got some green ones now okay so these are all the same we got a couple of uh, green tracks. Now we've got some blue ones. Call them blue. Uh, so seven of those. We have our sticker sheet and uh, instructions. Right, you should guide us. I've done the uh, complete range of uh, wave one and two. Mario movie figures, um, so check it all out if you are interested on the channel. And we've got a couple of two of these larger panels, which I assume the uh, squares sit on. So this is your main main base, and you uh, insert those wherever. So let's take a look at our paperwork. Okay, so sticker sheet. So I'll get those on and we'll take a look at it all later on. This is our set of instructions and this is a nice little uh, backdrop of Brooklyn. So pretty cool, just the one sided. Uh, it would have been nice if you had uh, two sides, maybe you can do like Brooklyn and Mushroom Kingdom or something like that, but uh, just the one side, still a very nice, uh, the detailed image there anyway. So um, guys, that's everything included in today's box. Like I said earlier though, stick around for the outro and I'll run through how it's all set up and uh, how it plays. But uh, do let us know in the comments what you think. And if you haven't already, do subscribe to the channel. But for now, we're going to conclude this part of the video.
Welcome back guys, so got it all set up and together. It does take a little bit of assembly. Obviously the stickers take the longest part. It does look pretty cool once the stickers are on the car though. It makes it actually look like the uh, Super Mario Brothers plumbing van. And then you've got a couple of stickers on the um, finishing line over here. So you set it up guys, you get your two big panels, you click them together. You've got your buttons, which are rubber feet. They go underneath to um, support it from moving during gameplay. You got your starting grid and your finishing grid. So you want to, what you need to do, guys, is you got to uh, get the van to the uh, the finish line, basically. And the player that does that is the player that wins. So what you need to do, you take turns, guys, in moving the uh, tiles around, so the uh, the van can make its way to the finish line. Um, if it does run off the track or um, tip over for um, for some reason, then um, that means that you've lost and um, you're out of the game and the other players keep playing to try and um, try and finish the game. Uh, what happens is, guys, you've got um, play, stop, and uh, fast forward, uh, or like a turbo. This takes two AAA batteries, so insert those and then this is powered up. You push play, guys, and he'll automatically start driving. You tap the uh, roof and it'll go in reverse, okay? So he'll make his way around and you obviously got to stop him from falling off and make him make his way to the um, finish line. Uh, this is a, uh, a single star track. It gives you three stars, three different track styles to um, play around with. So one star, two star, three stars. In the uh, instructions, it just means it's more difficult and harder. So you obviously don't want it to, um, to do that and go off the, uh, the track because that means it's game over. Uh, depending on whose player's turn it was to uh, try and steer him away from there. Um, uh, obviously, you can do any combination you like with these tiles, guys. You've just got to leave yourself some room so you can move the tiles around, obviously. Um, so you, you don't have to have two spaces. You can just have the one because there's um, one spare tile here that we didn't use, one of the blue ones. Okay, so you can use that last tile and then you only got the one square to, um, to manipulate and move the, uh, the board around. All right, guys, well, um, hopefully that makes a little bit of sense. And if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel before you leave. Hit the like button. If you didn't, hit the dislike. Once we get to the next milestone, we'll do the next giveaway. So do subscribe if you're running for that. And we'll catch you next time.